Hey, what's up, everybody? This is your boy, Montre. Uh, you watch your frat brother TV. I'm gonna make this video real short. Just had a couple of things on my mind. Uh, you ever see like those stud lesbians, you know, the real uh, masculine ones? I, you know, sometimes I see them and I think, wow, you know, that dude is really cute. And then I look again, I'm like, wait a minute, what? What? That's a girl. So uh, I have a question. This is for the ladies out there, for the, for my for my lesbian sisters out there. How do you know the difference between a stud lesbian and a transgender, uh, a trans man, a, a male to a female to male transgender person? Um, I mean, where is that fine line between a stud lesbian and a transgender? Because to me, I think when I see somebody who looks like a boy, dresses like a boy, identifies with a boy name, uh, does everything that a guy would do, I would think that they'd be transgender, you know? If, 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 if it was a gay man doing that, if he was dressing up like a girl, wearing heels, had long hair, and calling himself, you know, peaches, you know, I'd be like, oh, he's, he's trans, he's, he's a trans man, he's a transgender. So, I mean, where do you draw that fine line between a lesbian and a transgender person, one who's in transition to become a man? So, that's my question for today. Uh, if you guys know what's the difference between a stud lesbian and a transgender, please let me know. I just want to educate myself, you know, because, you know, I don't want to be like offended. Somebody say, oh, you trans? But they're like, no, nah, no, nah, I'm a lesbian. You know, you know what I'm saying? I don't want to get in trouble. Yet, there are many lesbians that look like girls that you would never be able to tell the difference. So, this is why I'm asking. So, anyways, give me your two cents on that because if you don't do it, then who will? Peace out.